What's up everyone? Welcome back to the Coral Reef Talk. Today I'm going to share another fish tank profile. Today I want to introduce you to Samson, my maroon clownfish and maroon clownfish tend to be on the more aggressive side of all the clownfish that you can get in your tank. Now these clownfish are easy to keep as with most and they will host anemones. Just keep in mind that they can be bad tempered and be very aggressive in your tank. Now maroon clownfish can be found off the coast of Africa, Australia, the Indo-West Pacific, and many other places in the ocean. They're also a captive bred fish. Now Samson has been with me way longer than any of the other fish in my system. He started just like Larry the yellow tang in my 75 gallon tank, which I moved and upgraded to this 210 gallon tank. Now most people start with Ocellaris clownfish, the you know the Finding Nemo clownfish, um, typical bright orange white stripes. Maroon clownfish are darker in color, nice maroon color with white stripes. Now the one in my tank, his name is Samson and he gets that name because he's very very strong. Now he's also very aggressive at times in my tank when I add new corals he'll tend to want to pick them up, move them to the other side of the tank and he doesn't really care what you think. He can be very aggressive to new fish as well. Whenever I introduce a new tank mate, he's one of the first ones to go check them out and say, hey, this is my tank, what are you doing here? And I need you to know that this is my space, this is my area, so back off. In my tank, I have two other clownfish. I have a pair of Ocellaris clownfish. Now, typically you don't wanna mix your clownfish up, or most people say that you don't wanna mix them up because of the aggression. Now because of the size of my tank the aggression has been minimal but there is still some kind of back and forth there. Uh, the mated pair this is like hey this is our territory back off. The maroon clownfish Samson is like this is my tank I've been here longer. So there's still a little bit of aggression but overall it's been working out really well and everyone typically gets along. So thank you so much for checking out this video. I hope you learned something. Please leave me a like and a comment down below. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and we'll see you next time on the Coral Reef Talk.